Father God, Jesus our Saviour, Holy Spirit our Helper, we worship you at this time. We thank you for bringing us together as one family of believers around your presence at this time of this day. It is indeed beautiful and graceful to be here at this time of the evening worshipping and adoring God Let us worship our God as Jesus taught us love your God with all your heart with all your mind with all your soul and with all your strength. Let us do this in silence remembering whatever that took place in our life today Whatever the way that we experience the hand of God on our life today, let us continue to worship the Lord in our hearts and minds.
Let us also examine our life today. The time that we got up from the bed till at this point of time on earth. Knowingly or unknowingly, the moments that we hurt or we break the relationship with God. offering those moments of sin or sinfulness of this day thanking god for his promise that the whole heaven will be happy about the one who repents about his sin Let us try to reconnect with the God sincerely from our heart of all the sins that happened in our life today. We are loving children of God. Let us take a couple of minutes reflecting and meditating on the gospel passage of today. We already had a reflection on the same passage, but good to reflect. different aspects of today's gospel Jesus told us this morning a parable of a king who entrusted his talents or pounds with the people especially to three people equally distributed 1 pound each and we know what those three servants did with this 3 pounds first one added 10 more second one added 5 more and the third one couldn't do anything and jesus said at the end of the parable especially to the first and the second one who added more talent more pounds with the first he said i will entrust to you more things because of your faithfulness in little things and jesus was not at all happy with the third one who didn't do anything with the one pound let us reflect in the presence of god what talents that i have received in my life what is the pound in my life in order to do the business 
or in order to use the opportunities in order to multiply this pound we need to know what we possess if we are not aware about what we possess what talents we have what pounds that is in our personal life it's difficult to multi multiply this so let us examine in silence what i have received everyone is received everyone is received something or the other from god what i am received what is my pound what's my talent from god whatever it may be in order to multiply this we need to know our pound we need to know our talents spend time in silence pray with to god try to discern what is given to us personally Thank you Lord for this time helping me to reflect what I received from you in fact everything I have received from you but particularly looking on what I received as pounds or talents in my personal life to multiply this on earth Lord I also remember and I say sorry 
even though i have received much i could not use all these talents in my life even though i am the anointed i am the right person who received a lot of blessings received maybe more pounds and talents but couldn't make use of much as you wish on me thank you lord for reminding me once again about the faithfulness and help me to do something with the pound that i received in my life for the glory of god on earth preparing your children to welcome your second coming preparing the whole world preparing our own near and dear ones to welcome you in the world Thank you Lord for helping us. Thank you Lord for hiding each one of us in the wounds of your sacred heart. Thank you Lord for filling our hearts with your love. Thank you Lord for anointing us with your spirit and guiding everyday life with your grace. that's what we are in search of that's what we are in need of thank you lord thank you jesus
dear loving children of God, wherever you are right now, if you can open your both hands, let us acknowledge God for these pounds or talents in my personal life. Let us worship God. Whatever that we have received from Him, in spite of all our unfaithfulness of past days or years, still God is blessing me every day with His talents and pounds. Let us worship the Lord. Forgetting about our vulnerabilities and sins, instead focusing the goodness and the love and the mercy of God by His authority over each one of us. Let us worship the Lord along with our families, along with our, along with our parents and siblings, your spouse and your children. If they are not with you physically, Remember their presence spiritually with you. Worship the Lord together for His name and for His glory. Thank you, Lord. Praise you, Jesus. We worship you, Father. We adore you, Father. Thank you, Lord, for giving us a good heart. Thank you, Lord, for all the talents and pounds in our personal life. Thank you, Lord, for using us powerfully as an instrument for thousands of people. Thank you, Lord, for us blessing with the good people in and around us. Thank you, Lord, for all the opportunities every day. Thank you, Lord, for all that we enjoy in your name. Thank you, Lord, for your blessings and talents in our personal life. Thank you, Jesus. Praise you, Jesus. Hallelujah, 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 Lord. We worship you at this evening as we are about to go for a good rest. We acknowledge your presence and your help and your love in spite of all our unfaithfulness. Thank you, Lord. Praise you, Jesus. Your powerful presence in our life. Every day we acknowledge this that only you can satisfy us. Only you can feed us and we possess only you, Lord. Thank you, Father. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Holy Spirit. Hallelujah, 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 Lord. We worship you, Lord, on behalf of my family. The people who are not able to worship on behalf of them, I worship you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Praise you, Jesus. Hallelujah, Father. Thank you, Holy Spirit. Praise you, Holy Spirit. Worship you, Holy Spirit, for your guidance and leadership in my life, for your blessings and protections in my life, for your providence and your graces on my everyday life. Hallelujah, hallelujah. Thank you, Lord. Praise you, Jesus. Hallelujah, Jesus. Thank you, Lord. Praise you, Jesus. Worship you, Father. Adore you, Father. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah, Lord. Praise you, Lord. Thank you, Jesus. Praise you, Jesus. Hallelujah, Lord. Thank you, Jesus, for your convictions and for blessing us with the right teachings, right intentions. Thank you, Lord. Praise you, Lord. Hallelujah, Father. Worship you, Lord. Lord, we give glory and honor to your holy name. Lord, help us to honor our vocation. Help us to be responsible in our vocation. Help us to use all the pounds and talents in our vocation for your glory. Thank you, Lord. Praise you, Lord. Hallelujah. Praise you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Worship you, Jesus. Adore you, Jesus. Love you, Jesus. Hallelujah, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Praise you, Jesus. Surrendering our personal intention at the feet of Jesus in silence. Today, during Holy Mass, we prayed for our own personal intention. We need to pray for our own self. 
not not for maybe different needs or wants instead guide me every day with the right intention guide me every day with the spirit of god help me to carry up all my burdens help me to overcome all my bad habits help me to be patient and silence help me to honor my vocation remembering all the prayer requests of the people who approached to divine retreat center today surrendering all your personal intention worshiping god at this time through facebook and youtube offering your intentions a parents and siblings your spouse and your children or the departed members or families let us sing together down in adoration falling Lord Jesus Christ you gave us the Eucharist as the memorial of your suffering and death may our worship of this sacrament of your body and blood help us to experience the salvation you want for us and peace of the kingdom where you live with the father and the holy spirit one god forever and ever let us do the divine praises together blessed be god blessed be his holy name blessed be jesus christ to god and to man blessed be the name of jesus blessed be his most sacred heart blessed be his most precious blood blessed be jesus in the most holy sacrament of the altar blessed be the holy spirit the paraclete blessed be the great mother of god mary most holy Blessed be her holy and immaculate conception. Blessed be her glorious assumption. Blessed be the name of Mary, Virgin and Mother. Blessed be Saint Joseph, her most chaste spouse. 
Blessed be God in his angels and in his saints. Amen.